and welcome back to Dual Wisdom. I'm your host SVG and today we have yet another Decret unboxing video and this time around it's the July edition. Now guys I've really gone through a lot of Decret unboxings by now and if you really want to take a look at them then I'll be really happy if you click on the link given right here is the link to all of the playlist for all the Decret videos. So guys as I already said it's the July edition and without any further ado guys let's get started right to the action. Alright guys, so this is the July screen and let's go at it now. Alright, so there are a few things that catch my attention obviously. First of all, we're gonna do with the sheet, the cursed sheet, and put it at one side, or rather just throw it away for now. Second of all, obviously you're gonna see here a Pokeball. What do you have here? Well, a Pokeball. And you can also see that there's M written on it. So let's take a look at this first. Alright, so here guys, you see there's the Pokeball uh, with the M on it. So I am pretty sure this is the Master Ball. Uh, with only being a single one in the whole world, this is a pretty unique thing to give in a box like that. Uh, let's take a look at this. Chris Tate. Alright. Now we take a look at this and uh, basically it's a ball made out of plastic and so let's try to open this. How do you open? Oh, okay. That's nice. Right, so basically it's kind of like a container in which you can keep keep various kind of things, maybe pen drives or uh, anything small, keys or anything like that I guess. And uh, well that's about that. I mean this is pretty cool. Uh, obviously they had to make the button to open the thing over here so that's kind of intelligent. <laughs> But it's a pretty simple yet an effective thing to give uh, in a subscription box like this. So yeah, that's that's kind of nice. Let's move on to the next item now. Alright, moving on I see a keychain. Now this is apparently a keychain from, as it says, it's the Walking Dead. Oh wow, this is gonna be nice. Alright, I see it from here so it looks like metal to me. Complete metal and something like a bow arrow, maybe an arrow. Yeah, let's take a look at this guys. This looks pretty promising. Alright guys, so here it is. This is the Walking Dead keychain and as you can see right here, it's, I, I believe it's crossbow. Yeah, it's a crossbow. So yeah, let's take a look at this guys. Alright, here it goes. Here it is guys. Now we take a look at this from here. This is a really nicely made crossbow if I must say. Uh, there are a few detailings here and there and uh, it also has its weight to it also they put up this the walking dead amc thing and uh, well basically it's a decent little keychain i mean not just geek crate but other subscription boxes for some reason they have really nice tastes for keychains and they really do good with that they really choose what's the best thing to get for a keychain and this really has got to be one of them so this is a really nice thing to give as well Closing up, we can see all of its details, its shine, and that's something really nice because uh, that just tells that they've really given it the time to work on a crossbow. And basically, for any Walking Dead fan, which I think there are many, considering the TV serial and also the really awesome game for the PC and other platforms, this is gonna be really nice for anyone. Yeah, guys, this is a really nice thing to give to a Walking Dead fans. Yeah, that's something that's that's something kind of really nice. Moving on, we see the t-shirt. But as a custom, the only rule that we have actually followed in every Geek Red video, apart from putting away the cursed sheet, is to open the t-shirt at the last. And this time the t-shirt is actually over something, so that must mean something. Let's take a look at the thing that's below the t-shirt. Right here t-shirt is always gonna be the main attraction of the box and here we see that it's a cap all right so basically this is a cap from Harry Potter of Hufflepuff and uh, <clears throat> apparently as far as I think they might have given different caps uh, with different names written over different caps to different people which I think is really intelligent considering if you have a friend who, uh, who bought the same D crate and is gonna receive something different although we are gonna just uh, Confirm that at the end of the video when we look at the sheet of paper. So yeah, let's open this up guys. Mm -hmm. 
All right, so the first impression from me to this cap is, uh, well, that it's, well, it's really soft, if anything. I mean, it's really elastic, it's gonna be really comfy. That's the first thing that comes to my mind after looking at this cap. It's really gonna be useful in the winters, obviously. And, uh, well, well, I'm pretty impressed because usually they don't really give any variables like t-shirts and boxes and this I think the first time they've actually given any variable apart from t-shirts that's really awesome guys this this really feels really nice in the hands and everything so that's that's really nice all right guys so here we have reached at the end item of the box you can see that it's a black t-shirt and the crate kind of has a thing for black t-shirts so yeah let's take a look at this t-shirt the last item of the box and as we can see here the box is empty so let's throw it away all right guys, so here's the t-shirt. Oh my boy, what do we have here? This is, I have no problem guessing what this might be. The onset of Suicide Squad in July. It had to be coming. We should have expected that much. I mean, we received Batman and Superman. We got the Captain America versus Iron Man t-shirt. So this had to be coming. Literally guys, this t-shirt is awesome. Literally awesome. I have actually, I've got no words for this. I mean, they really know what to give people at the right time. Uh, well, if you've seen the movie, then obviously you would have noticed that the kind of outfit that Harley Quinn wears in this t-shirt is not pretty much similar to the one that they show her wearing in the movie. Which I think is intelligent because uh, Harley Quinn really has went through a lot of different costumes and a lot of different hairstyles even in the comics. So she kind of evolved and this form was one of her forms while she was evolving. Because in the first one she used to wear this weird hat of, uh, of the same colors. Uh, but apparently this had to be on a black t-shirt. And well this just seems to be really nicely made. Uh, again this is a really soft material. And uh, let's see. It's, it's, it's made by guys from Top Notchy. Top Notchy. It's, it's funny, they always give t-shirts of different companies, which is kind of nice as well, because that way you get to know which all companies make these kind of great t-shirts. And the print seems to be really nice as well. And as you can see, this is a picture. And with, uh, you know, basically there are some t-shirts which have this square in the middle, and there are some t-shirts like this, which have the background to be alpha, which goes away with the t-shirt, which I really like. And this is definitely again going to be one of my favorite t-shirts given by Geekway because this is a really nice choice to give at the right point of time. Alright, so as we can see from the sheet of paper, we were correct about guessing that Hufflepuff's cap was of different names to different people. As we can see here, it's Gryffindor and it's also written that different caps out of the four houses in Hogwarts were given to different people. Which is kind of really nice because uh, that way every one of four person will have a unique cap, which is nice. As always, this crate as well was really interesting and everything else was also similar to the ones that we got so that's really reassuring. So thank you guys for staying till the end of the video. I hope you liked it and if you did, please click that subscribe button and give that like button a click. Also, if there's anything you want to say, anything you want to comment about, please do so in the comment section below and I'll be sure once. Sure. Now guys, I've been saying this before in my videos as well, you're gonna see an eye icon on the top right corner of the screen. As soon as you click on that, there's going to be a poll of all the items that were inside this box. Click on any one of them and it'll let me know what was the people's choice item of this July's crate. With that said, this is the end of this video guys. And as always, do make sure to check in again guys and so I'll you to Geeky Live.